fresh tomatoes, one large onion, three serranos, seven cloves of garlic, five dried wahilo peppers with the stems removed, three ancho chilies with the stem and seeds removed, a half a tablespoon of smoked paprika, salt, Mexican oregano, black pepper, and cumin. Beef broth. Bring this to a low boil covered and I'm gonna let it cook for 30 to 45 minutes till the vegetables are soft. Three pounds of Angus chuck cubed up and one pound of oxtail. Cover thoroughly with sea salt, fresh ground black pepper. Make sure you get in there and mix it around. You want the salt and pepper to cover all the meat. In a skillet, add two tablespoons of hog lard. Place your meat in the skillet. You wanna get a sear on all sides. You're just trying to get a sear on all sides of your meat about like that. You're not cooking it all the way through. Our vegetables are done and cooled down. Now we're going into the blender with them. Now put the lid on and puree. In your slow cooker, add your meat, medium diced onion, and all your puree. Add about a cup of water to your blender to wash it out good and add that. I got the crock pot on high and I got it up to a simmer now. I'm going to add these bay leaves. I'm going to put the lid on it for four hours. While that's cooking, grate you some cheese that you like. Spooning this oil off the top, because we take this oil and that's what we fry the... Some of the gravy I dipped out, I'm going to add some fresh lime, some fresh chopped cilantro, a little more onion. Now I'm going to pull some of the meat out and shred it for the tacos. Now dip your tortilla down in the oil, lay it in your skillet or on a griddle, add some of your shredded beef, add whatever cheese you like. I'll add some cilantro in mine. Just fold them over and let them start frying. All right, here it is. Let's see what they taste like. These things are awesome. 